Hi, welcome to Mycology. In this video, we are going to create exercise number 72. So first, we will create this front view in front plan because uh, by this uh, front view, we can create the basic shape of that. And once we will create this front view, we just need to use extruded boss command to create the basic shape. And uh, after that, we will use the extruded cut to create this cut and create this cut. Right. So let's go on SOLIDWORKS and create this exercise. So first we select the front plan and go to sketch. Now we select uh, one center arc, center point arc, right? And go on arc like that. And select the smart dimension. The radius of this arc is 240, right? And second important thing, this point and this origin. Uh, vertical so apply vertical over here right we don't know the, uh, the distance between this point and this origin right so we just uh, keep it like that and now select the line and draw one line like that make it vertical now select the smart dimensions and the distance from here to here is 173 right and we don't know exact distance of this right so we just uh, keep it like that now select the line and draw one more line here like that and the, this thickness is uh, sorry not thickness but this width is 60 the length of this line is 60 right apply ok now select again center uh, point arc and draw one arc like that the radius of this arc is 50 so apply 50 and now select these three points the first one this the center and this point and make horizontal right. and now select the line and draw a vertical line like that and now select the circle and draw one circle like that select this this point and this point and make horizontal select this circle and this line and make tangent and the diameter of this circle is 50 so apply 50 <coughs> now select one more circle and go inside it and this circle diameter is around yeah this 13 now select the line again and we'll go one more line like that and now select this line this point sorry and this point and make coincident and now select this line this line and this line and make equal and parallel that and now select the smart dimension the length of this line is 5 mm right. and distance from here to this origin that is 284 now ok so yes this distance is 55 and this distance is 85 this one is 30 and this distance uh, this total distance here to here that we know it is 256 right so we have all things now right now we just need to select this center point arc and go arc like that say so not center point select three point arc here is a uh, three point arc, select this one, select this point, this point and make like that, Leave it like that right. Now select uh, this and the uh, <coughs> radius of this is 10, so it is 10, right. okay, so I delete this one, there is some problem. 
I don't know what is the exit problem over here. Now again select this three point arc and the one arc like that. Select this arc and this one. Make tangent. Radius of this arc is 10. Now select this one and this one and make tangent. See this arc and this arc and make tangent. Right now it is fully defined. Right now <coughs> select the line command. Okay, first uh, we need to create one more thing. Select the line. Now first select the offset entity and select this one. And here this select the select chain and this 15, not this not 15, it is 9. And sorry, it is 9 and give us the direction and apply OK. Right now, select the line and go on line like that. Select three entities and bring this one. Make this line vertical. Now, select your fillet. Select this one. This fillet is 5 mm. Apply OK. Right now, select a line and draw one line here, which is vertical, and draw one more line here, which is also vertical. Right now, again, select the offset entities and select offset entity and select this one. Reverse the direction and it is 15 mm. Apply OK. Now select the line command and draw one line like that. Now select the trim entities and trim this all. Select smart dimension and this is 15 is already given so we don't need to give it right okay just think this one also so now apply this is 15 apply okay <coughs> and select this one and this one and make concentric right now select smart dimension this distance is 15. This distance is also 15. And this distance is 16. Now select the fillet. Select all four corners. It is 5 in a fillet. Apply OK. Now select the circle and go one circle here. Select smart dimension and distance of this circle from here is 15. Diameter of this circle is 15. And select the center of this circle and select the center point of this uh, line and make vertical. So now it is fully defined, right? Now select the fillet and select this one and it is 15. Apply OK. Now anything else is remain. Let's check. Um, okay. Yeah, we can also apply the fillet over here. So here is a file. If we can okay. We can apply fillet after explaining it. Okay. So it is easy to create this field right now exit now we have basic shape here right so we will um, now extrude it one by one to create the basic shape right so select the extrude boss and select this sketch here clear the selections and select this contour just this is like the theme features and it is around 200 now it is not around also it's absolutely 200 right and here select the mid plane and apply OK. Now again select both 
and select the same sketch now select this one and we are going to select offset and this offset is how much it is 30 give us the offset direction okay. it's 30 it is not big blend is blind and it is 49 Play okay. Now again select red balls and select the same sketch. Now select this one and this one. We will do this after. Okay. So delete this one and also delete this one. Just select this one and this one. So now we apply offset over here. How much offset it is? Offset is 92 by 2 plus 8 and this one is 70 minus 92 by 2 ok so 92 by 2 minus 8 apply ok now it is done now again select split boss the simple calculation you need to just uh, uh, think about it and apply the simple logic so you get this one right now select this contour and here select the media plan and this is 140 okay it is 140 okay this total 60 plus 49 plus 49 apply okay now we have select the mirror and select this front plane and select the features to mirror this one and this one and apply ok now select this face and go to sketch select the center point rectangle and go on center point rectangle like that select this line and this line and make call in here right and uh, this distance is 90 and this distance is 92 and select smart dimension okay and this distance is 8 now select the features and select where to cut and reverse the directions first flip side to cut no sorry flip side but here select blind and this 4 ok we need to do, just need to change something ok Select this one, select this line and this line and make tangent. Now go to export and cut. And here select the blind, it is 4 and apply OK. Now select top plan and go to sketch. Select center point rectangle and go like that. Select smart dimension. This distance is 18 and this distance is 35. Now select the features and select where cut. And we are select up to next. Here's the directions and apply OK. Now we just need to apply the fillets over there, right? And it is finished. Now select the fillet. First, we apply in this slot which we have created recently. Select this one. Select this edge. Then select this edge. And this one is a four. Apply OK. Okay. Select this one again. We just need to change something. Select this edge. and select this edge and 
now then select the fillet and now here is a 5 mm fillet select this one this one this one this one this one this one select this one also select all relevant edges Okay, so now that is selected, anything else is remaining that we check. Okay, so if this one if we can select it, not selected, then just uh, left it sorry leave it okay we will apply fillet once we will apply it here now select this one and this one so now our exercise is completed now we apply appearance to it Select body, and select this one, apply OK, and this is our isometric view. If you like this video, please share, subscribe, and like. Thank you for watching.